On the snow white shores of the Gulf of Mexico, at the Florida Alabama line, lies a beachside honky tonk where songwriters have gathered for more than three decades to tell their stories through the magic of song. It is a congregation of the human spirit. The bright lights of stardom traded for the warm glow of an intimate stage. Here, the songwriters come to be heard, and everyone else comes to listen. In the hallowed halls of the legendary Floribama Lounge, their music lives forever. Woke up this morning, sun not shining. The songwriter is a rare breed. Found my broken mind in a brown paper bag. They know three chords on the guitar, maybe. But in those three chords, they can find a universe of expression. When you hear the songwriter sing the song, the person who wrote it, you're really hearing that song for the first time. And now you have something like a big songwriting festival at the Floribama, and it's taking that message to the world and saying, here's how this music that you love is formed and crafted and created. I was introduced to the Frank Brown Festival by uh, Wayne Carson. Give me a ticket for an airplane. You need to go with me, so just grab your bag. Ain't got time to take a fast train. Lord, it has gone. I'm coming home. My baby just wrote me a letter. The fun thing for me was getting to meet all the people that, songs that I grew up on. I mean, songs that made me want to be a writer, made me want to sing. Nothing on but the radio. This place holds so much tradition. So many of the greats that came through here and played at this festival. And the guru of this whole festival is a guy named Joe Gilchrist. The idea was to bring as many eccentric characters as possible together and play music for them, see what the hell happened. Since the floor of Bama was 20 feet by 20 feet, Joe had music. Joe said, I'll pour the whiskey, you play the music, you know, and that's instant friends there. Joe made it all happen. His personality, his love of music, his love of songwriters. You can't get any closer to the bone than the person who created the song. Songwriting to me has always been a way for me to cope with living. And on that plane back to Tennessee My mind comes across her memory Yesterday In Marina Del Rey When somebody comes up and they go, your song changed my life. That's why I do it. It's like a calling. We couldn't wait to go to the house across the street over there and there'd be 20 songwriters in there passing a guitar around and you talk about magic. My temperature is rising. Songwriters in every room in the house, every bathroom, every bedroom. I could have played it better, but boy, I was drunker than a skunk. You would have had to have been there. What it comes down to is music and the people that create the music. That's what's made it work and what's made it last. The whole idea was just to have a good time, and we were pretty good at it. Welcome to our clubhouse. There's nothing like it on earth. My baby just wrote me a letter. 